I am Asilla, once queen to our beloved Leoric. My servants and I were consumed by his madness. Now I give you my blessing, champion, to release my people from their eternal torment. needs to recharge. Give it more time. to release me from this torment. Thank the gods. My gods! There is someone amongst us. Deal with him harshly!
you, champion. My servants are now free, but the curse over this place remains. Seek the warden of the dungeon center. Should I trade? is ready as you requested thank you Lazarus your loyalty is invaluable in the midst of all these traitors and you my dear my own wife and queen conspiring against our kingdom
have more people in his dungeons than some rulers have in their entire kingdoms. That needs to recharge. Give it more time. malaise has fallen over the manor we now call home. Young Albrecht seems to be enjoying himself in our new home, however. Perhaps I am simply suffering from an imbalance of humors brought on by the recent change of climate. down there. You seem afraid. <laughs> no. Just wondering what Leah must be back in Tristram crying over the old man's corpse. We'll soon have another one to cry over. Yours. Meet the Butcher. <laughs> Fresh meat! I hunger! Need meat! That needs to reach 
charge. That's over. I'm willing to split this half and half with you. I'll take half now, and then half when we get back to town. That will do very well. Your sword. My sword. I remember now. I was an archangel of the high heavens. I was the embodiment of justice. I was. I am. Tyrael. You have restored my mind, friend. And now, I remember the warning I came to deliver. Belial and Asmodan, the last lords of hell, are unleashing a tide of darkness that will drown this world. Already, Belial's shadow has fallen upon Chaldeum. The priests of Rathma feared this would come to pass. We must move quickly. Let us return to Tristram and make ready. Time grows short, my friends. Even now, Belial's influence is spreading through Chaldeum. But how will we find him? We won't have to. Magda and her coven will lead us straight to him. I'm not going anywhere until Uncle Deckard's been laid to rest. There is time enough for that. I have called for a caravan to guide us to the east. Speak to the caravan master when you are ready to go. We will see to Cain as we depart. My friend, shall we depart to Chaldeum?
I have some... I like you. You... My friend, shall we depart to Chaldeum? My friend, shall we depart to Chaldeum? you know about the sacrifice? Imperium! The ancient law of the High Heaven strictly forbids us from interfering with the mortal world. Yet you have done so, brazenly! All I am guilty of, Imperius, is bringing justice, while you hide, cowering behind your throne. Silence! Now answer for your transgressions! You cannot judge me! I am justice itself! We were meant for more than this. To protect the innocent. But if our precious laws bind you all to inaction, then I will no longer stand as your brother. You chose to be one of us. Sacrilege. Uncle, 
I will carry on for you. Here we are, Chaldeum, Jewel of the East. Uncle Deckard loved this place. He wouldn't now that it is under the spell of Belial, Lord of Lies. I can smell his stench on the air. It would be best to split our forces. You two search for Belial. I shall hunt Magda. Most of my items have almost no blood left on them. May the gods who abandoned us come to your aid one last time. New goods today. Please look, you won't be disappointed. I heard you came here from Tristram. My family came from there. That place has had some very bad luck, hasn't it? I must wait. Were you born into the Templar Order? No. Our scripture says, as a farmer reaps his wheat, so must the Order harvest and purify the weeds. And you do not take offense to that? You speak out of kindness, but you do not understand. When they took me, they saved my life and my immortal soul. Some heroes are fighting each other in an area near here. Wanna go? Oh, and uh, you didn't hear about it from me. <laughs> Are you guarding the refugees over there? I am not a guard. I am a Shearer, commander of the Iron Wolves. We saved these refugees from Magda's coven. It even now wreaks havoc throughout the borderlands. 
Where did you last see her? She's heading toward Alcanus, but has blocked the road behind her. However, there is another way. Through the Kasim outpost. All of these people have fled from the cultists in Alcanus. They are refugees far from their homes. Why can't they resettle within the city? The Imperial Guard lets no one in. These people are sentenced to a slow death. Tyrion and I learned that while the Iron Wolves were fighting Magda in the desert, the Emperor replaced them with Imperial Guards who bar all from the inner city. I suspect that the Iron Wolves were sent out to die. Belial has made his move. We must find a way into the city. As a child, I explored Chaldean while Uncle Deckard studied here. I can get in through the sewers. Just see that you get out again in one piece. Be careful. Alcarnas sounds like Magda's trap. I've got some. I find all sorts of things down in the aqueducts. I like the shiny ones the best. This gate leads to Alcanus. You'll need to follow the long road over the canyon bridge and through the Kasim outpost. We haven't heard anything from the Iron Wolves in the desert. If you make it to the Kasim outpost, seek out Captain David. Something tells me this will be an interesting journey. Take heed, traveler. Cultists guard these desert roads, and they will slay any who pass. I mean to stop them. Then you must not go alone. I shall accompany you. Well now, it's my lucky day. There are illusions out there. Mirages to some. But I can see them for what they are. The Coven's foul magic. They will lead you to your death. I understand. My death does not lie here. They're in the rocks. of magic and illusion are familiar to me. My name is Arena. Why have you come here? Well, I am also looking for someone. But here, let me clear the way for you. Captain, from behind! Protect the people! I will! If not for you, the Lacuni would have eaten well this day. Are there more of them ahead? Even worse. Cultists are casting spells in two of their desert lairs to obscure the Black Canyon Bridge. Let us head north to the Howling Plateau. The cultist magic seems to be emanating from there. another illusion here. The cultists try to hide their footsteps. Their spells are weak and easily countered. 
If we follow these prints, we can find their lairs and halt the rituals. I will seek out any other traces of their magic. I understand so much more now. Completely worth it. No. Seriously, that's just the thing. I must wait.
fear the end. That needs to recharge. to the east of here. What? The... I owe you my life. Bless you. Look, more hidden footprints. footprints.
More hidden footprints. part of the illusion inside as long as you aren't an illusion too whatever do you mean you do when Magda is dead? Kill the demon lord she serves. How curious. You must be the one I was meant to find here. for you to know my true tale. I am not from Chaldeum. I learned these spells 1500 years ago. My sisters and I pledged our service to a man of great power. We called him the Prophet. He trained us and placed us in a magical slumber to awaken in this era. I am to prevent the Lords of Hell from invading. The Prophet? I have not heard of this figure. But your aid is welcome. I welcome the chance to travel with you. I am fond of this one. You will find it to the north, though it is still some distance away. in the air. We must be getting closer. Well met, 
Master Metan. What have you discovered here? Powerful spirits haunt these ruins. I was not strong enough to defeat them, but I was able to trap them. I fear the coven that invades the region will try to use the spirits for their nefarious purposes. But if you dare, you can try to put them to rest. Activate the totems to release the spirits, and be prepared to fight. And you hear their angry voices. Still more remain. One more left. Dead are insidious, them. You cannot forget that. Been safe ever since the I need you to open the gate. You must be mad. But if you're intent on rushing headlong to your death, talk to Captain David down in the command post. He's got the gate key. Here you are, delivered unto me as a sacrifice. A gift from Lord Belial. Or oh, he's setting you up to fail. No! He would never betray me! Strike him down! Not a moment too soon. They plan to sacrifice us to Belial. Iron Wolves, take back the town! Magda go to Alcanus. Yes, we've heard rumors of a horrible slaughter there. Then I'll be on my way. I am returning to town. The 
there ain't no guards around, are there? Good, because I got some new items to show you. Death may be upon us all. I stayed outside last night. I tried to ignore the silence, but the empty air felt like an open mouth above my head. Eventually I realized I had to sleep. If someone was going to kill me, I was already dead. I hadn't slept that well in years. <laughs> 